Finally, tonight there was a big unveiling in London today for the first official portrait of Kate, the Duchess of Cambridge. The reviews came in kind of instantly. There were polite comments at the time, but then they took a decided turn south. And put it this way, it's not the first time a high-profile painted depiction has come under fire. We get the story tonight from NBC's Kate Snow. She is arguably the most photographed woman in the world, flawless in nearly every photo, which may be why so many in Britain think this painting, with the shadows and lines under her eyes, the half-smile, doesn't do justice to the actual Duchess. Mercifully, she hasn't got a nose remotely like that. Uh, the eyes are wrong. <laughs> I could go on. The Duchess viewed the painting this morning. She had two sittings with the artist last year. Paul Emsley made a portrait of Nelson Mandela, but specializes in realistic drawings of rhinos and other wildlife. What she wanted uh, herself is to, that the portrait should con uh, convey her natural self as opposed to her official self. But portraits can be tricky. This 2001 portrait of the Queen had one critic suggesting the artist be locked in the tower. When Winston Churchill was given this portrait as a gift from Parliament, he said he looked like a half-wit and told his wife to destroy it after he died. Presidents are hard to please, too. LBJ called his official portrait the ugliest he'd ever seen. And one critic quipped this likeness of Bill Clinton, commissioned for Washington's National Portrait Gallery, looked more like Ted Koppel. A good portrait, in my point of view, makes you think that you're sitting in front of the person. New York portrait artist Marvin Mattelson sells his paintings for as much as $45,000 and agreed to let me sit for a quick 30-minute version. You can't please everyone, so there's only two people that you want to please. You want to please yourself and you want to please your client. If anyone else is happy, that's a bonus. The Duchess, an art history major herself, is said to be thrilled with her portrait. I'm done. All right. This is a finished study. Oh, wow. So what I see that you got is yeah. you, the look in my eyes. And in the end, if the Duchess likes hers, too, that's all that really matters. Kate Snow, NBC News, New York.